Why? Oh, hey there! Welcome to Single File Line, what should be episode 30, but is actually episode 29, because somebody doesn't know how to turn off his Windows update. We're recording last episode, you know, great episode, got all the way to the end, like an hour and change long, it was a hilarious episode, mm-hmm. and you know, we're about to do our synchronized goodbye, end of the episode, and then we all look at Dakota, his room, Goes black. He looks at his screen. He's like, I pod champed apparently. (laughs) And then he drops from the call, (laughs) comes back a few minutes later, and he's like, The recording is corrupted, guys. (laughs) (laughs) And that was that. Yeah. (laughs) Okay, I. What am I supposed to do about Windows being Windows, man? I don't. Do what you did this week. Turn off Windows. Updates. They're turned off now, bro. It didn't <laughs> warn me. It didn't say nothing. It didn't tell me beforehand. It didn't say fucking Windows, dude. I hate Windows. <laughs> All right, but 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 at least, at least my computer that. didn't blue screen leader when we were playing Forza. Moving on. Yep, Those lane. Are two- yeah, you're right. <laughs> but I didn't lose an hour long recording. I know, I know. I'm just trying to make myself feel better, okay? All right. All right. Just say he doesn't want a solo in Fortnite. True. Ooh. Lane, I won back to back the other day. I haven't loaded the game up in. Dakota, was it back to back or was it within 10 matches? <laughs> <laughs> no, this was for real back to back. Mildly right, impressive. Anyway. <laughs> So, um, so, so we can move on to the music. So since we did an episode last week that never went live, then we have music that was stated last week, but we never went over music from two weeks ago, right? Something like that. So we will quick, I don't know. (laughs) I have no clue you said, but. (laughs) Yo, we will go over the music real quickly that was in the last episode that we said. Um, yeah. I think we should just do a quick rating on it this week. Real quick recap, right? Real quick recap. So, so we did. Um, I won't back down. Tom Petty, absolute classic. Fucking classic. Classic. I liked it for what it was. All right. The classic. <laughs> Topanga, no. Trippy Red. I basically said I liked the instrumental. I hated his voice. I just, I just, I don't know. Not my playlist. That was a song about guns, right? Lots yeah, of yeah, guns. I think so. Yeah, yeah. And no, it's uh, about a girl. <laughs> okay, maybe not. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> it's you been should two go weeks. back and read the lyrics again. I'm not sure about that one. I think, but, uh, Lane, I've noticed lately when I show you a, a rap song not on the show, you, you comment basically on the chorus, and that's it. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, oh, wait, this, is not, this is not anyway, briefly this is touching not supposed to turn into a up on these, um, on these things. So, anyways, the third song, Alkaline, Cut of the Friend. Um, it was better, I but it... I not remember. It, it, I, I remember it being track, better. Trippy melodically sings about gun possession and gun violence. That's from Genius. Okay, well, Genius are a bunch of geniuses, so. <laughs> there you go. Lane, Lane Alkaline. Not, or wait, not, yeah. Not about, wait, that was not about a girl. But yeah, that was my uh, It was okay. Was song. Yeah, I mean, it was it was fine. I don't really remember what I said about it. I'm sorry. Is that the rap one? Yeah, yeah it's the rap I said one. it was better than, than Nick's, but it's, I, I was think super duper chill one. I was met on it. It's very laid back. All right, so that was our super quick recap of uh, our song. So then (laughs) we recorded an episode last week, and we had, like, our normal talk about those songs. Then we stated new songs, but nobody ever knew these new songs. Now we're (laughs) going to go over these new songs. Then we're going to state new songs after that. So So how about we all, like, state our songs really fast, like, individually, and then we can go over them. We don't don't have to go over fast. I mean, yeah, 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 we can do that. So, um, So I mean, mean, we can just go through the list, yeah. So, Lane, I think this... No, 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 Nick, this was you. Lupe Fiasco, Sun God Sam, and the California Drug Deals? Yep. Sun okay. God Sam. Sun God Sam. Okay, whatever. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Sun God Typo. Um, yeah. So, I don't know what it was about this song that, that I was just like... I mean, I like the vibe, and it was like by... Like, it wasn't a bad song by any means, but I got bored really quick, and I don't know why. It's a long song. I got kind like... Of, well. <laughs> It wasn't even should... like it wasn't even that it was long. It was just like, like it just wasn't doing it for me, man. It just didn't <laughs> click for me. Like it wasn't a bad song at all, but I just I don't know. I couldn't. Not for you. Yeah. yeah. I, I really know. liked it. I, I really get into liked it. most of the songs on that album. It's probably not my favorite off that album because there's some great songs. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but sure. I love that instrumental. The strings in that instrumental are so well produced. They sound so great. It fits the mm-hmm. mood really well. Uh, Lupe Lupe is just kind of spitting bars throughout it. It's pretty great he has a pretty good flow um there's some hit, 
yeah, it tells a good story for sure. There's some hints of the same theme of, you know, there's themes of slavery throughout the entire thing, and it's really, really well done. Not, not my favorite off the album, but that's a hard number to hit. It's definitely a great song. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Hell yeah. So, <clears throat> next song was mine. Um, Two Years Acoustic by Have Mercy. I dig it. Uh, They are in the genre of music that I really like, so... Like you said, that in the now deleted episode, uh, or the, the now corrupted episode, um, it's in the same genre of music as you know that indie emo kind of you know sorority no- noise kind of kind of sound. And I listen to a lot of their other their other music too, and it's it's all it's all pretty fun emo pop pop emo indie emo kind of stuff. Except all their music is blocked worldwide. Apparently, fuck me. Um, yeah, <laughs> what do you think about it, Nick? Whoops. <laughs> um. I... I didn't really like it that much, You're but I didn't person. like. I'm I didn't kidding, dislike or hate it. I just didn't like it. I mean, I don't know. I'm sure it's better than the normal version, like the acoustic version. I'm sure it's better than the other version. Try but... the other version. Fuck it. I mean, it's not like <laughs> screamy. Okay. It's yeah, not. It's I mean, singing. It's straight whole singing. Emo sound, unless it's like the kind of up and coming like emo rap that's been coming up. Like I haven't really been. What are you big on the about? E- I'm talking about Juice <laughs> World. I'm doing the same. I'm talking about Juice World. I'm talking. What about are you Trippy talking Red. about? I'm talking Juice about Juice World's emo. Yes. X's. Have you listened, bro? Yeah, yeah. I mean, sure. Little but he's always just. I'm sad. I got a girl yeah. broke my heart. I'm yeah. sad. Yeah. And that's that's Juice World in a nutshell. <laughs> X is very at least very cool. quick nutshell. Yeah. Yeah. X is X had a lot more trouble. Yeah. yeah. X is definitely emo rap. I'll give you that. Yeah. And Lil Peep, Trippy to an extent. He just has the aesthetic of it, and then. uh I, I just said one more, but I forgot. But yeah, it, it's an up and coming scene, basically. It's a new subgenre of rap that I will not be totally listening different to. than indie emo. Rock. Um, but yeah. So stylistically, it is. But. The last song is Lane's song. <laughs> Romeo and Juliet, Which Bo Johnson. Kind of wasn't really a song. It was totally a song. It's totally a song. That's See, not a like, song. okay, Lane. So this episode was corrupted and never went up. But I said that I heard of this guy before, and Lane goes. No, you haven't. Like, like yeah, I don't know. Like, I just so want to point out real quick that um, <laughs> this song has like 70k likes and like 3.2 million views. It's like, not that huge of a song on YouTube. And yeah, but I mean, like, it's got Spotify. a few million views. And th- here's the it's thing: it's not like he's tiny. It's not like this dude's underground. But no. I didn't expect you to hear about him. He's like a yeah. random genre. Like the very this isn't first music song you usually listen to. I've heard. I've heard this song. The very first song I ever heard from him was the Peach Scone song. And I when you're I, a peach. Scone. Yeah. Whenever I heard that song, I was like, I fell in love with them. Like it was, it was sick. So I started listening to, like all the recommended that was on it. So I just went down the list and like listened to quite a few of his songs when I first found them. And I've come back to them. I don't know how I initially found them, but I remember them. But the thing is, I talked to Cobb, my friend Cobb, who lives out in the country, doesn't have internet, doesn't know anything, doesn't know anything what's going on in the world. Like, like seriously, has no Straight clue up. what's going on in the world. He came to my house. And like he had no clue about about that that um, that synagogue shooting. He had no clue about it. It like a week after it happened, he had no clue who Brett Kavanaugh was. Like he has no clue what's going on in the world at all. Right? He knew exactly who I was talking about, Hobo Johnson. Nick didn't, and Nick knows more than Cobb, uh, dude. I, I guarantee you, not that many people know about him. And the grand yeah, I mean, I'm not thing. saying not a lot of people know about him, but it's not a shocker that that that. Some people know about him. I was just putting Dude, that out there. I didn't expect your musical tastes to have expanded to that far. So I'm, kudos I'm a to great you. person. Sorry. You know? Lane's <laughs> still salty about it. Super salty, bro. I knew his song. Later. Anyways, fucking love the song. I've heard the song, I mean, a million times. Not a million times, but I've heard it before. Um, I like, I like, I, dude, it's like spoken word, like you said. And uh, I, I love the vibe of it. Um, I, I still like the Peach Scone song better, dude. <laughs> but I mean, like, lyrically, I, I like at the end, like, the very end where he gets just, like, really, like, serious with it. Like, his parents right. divorced and shit. Um, I mean, that's why I picked that one is because yeah. my parents are divorced. Yeah, it's pretty so, like, relatable. I mean, it, it, he gets, like, really into it at, like, the very end of the song. And, like, it's 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 good, dude. It's good. I like him. What about you, Nick? I was not a big fan, to be honest. Um... I don't know if person. it's because of the spoken word style, which I'm not really used to, or I just like couldn't. It was hard. I don't. I, don't, I really don't know how to explain it other than the. Really, I really, I really don't know how to explain it other than. 
I just didn't vibe with it. It wasn't rap. Okay. Next. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. So um, we can do our uh, our songs for this week if you guys want. All right. Um. So I guess I'll go first. I I want to ask you a question real quick. I, I'm gonna ask both of you guys a question real quick. Um. Now I'm gonna go back to like classic rock for this week. You know, just Fuck to keep yeah. educating Nick. Um, now do I do like a pretty decently well, I mean, they're, they're both pretty decently well-known songs. Um, but this one's more upbeat, more like, like, like happy ish. And, uh, or, or, I mean, the other one's not sad, but it's nine minutes long. Yeah. I picked that one. (laughs) (laughs) I have a couple nine minute songs. Um, Hmm, what do I go with, dude? Nah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go I'll save the nine minute song. I'll save it. Oh, you're messing up, especially if you have more. Might as well throw out this nine minute song. You want me to? Yeah, Alright, dude. All My song it. is Life's Been Good by Joe Walsh. Okay. I'm down. I don't know that song actually, but I know Joe Walsh. I feel like I f- uh, once you hear it, you're gonna know like the opening guitar riff, everything. Yeah, it's another person where it's like I know the name, I'm aware of him in music, but I don't really listen to his music. I, I I'm sure you'll know the song once you hear it. But life's been good, Joe Walsh. Cool. I'll go next. Um, <laughs> Nick's like like low key pissed right now. I just got no, it's to a do- super good song, man. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> okay, so I really don't know what to pick because a bunch of actually great artists dropped music last night at midnight, but I haven't really had time to... Well, I've had time, but I've been watching RLCS all day, so I didn't really listen to any of the new music. So I'm going to throw out something that did come out this week, but, you know, I'm not crazy about it, but sure? I still like it enough to throw it out to see what you guys think. Um, the artist is Wi-Fi's Funeral. That's one word. W I F I S funeral, and uh, the song is "Alone as a Face Tat." I already don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm kind of on the chance. same boat, but I'll listen to it. <laughs> Alone as a part. face tat? What are you talking about, dude? What do you mean? <laughs> is it from the perspective of, of a face tat that doesn't have other face tat friends or something? <laughs> You're gonna have to listen to it, brother. <laughs> is it one lone face tat? <laughs> on this man's face that's like i need a friend there's no s at the end so you know damn <laughs> oh, i thought wow. you guys would just get a kick out of the title honestly but yeah lame <laughs> i'd like to go back to this uh topanga song for a second this verse <laughs> okay that's not what we're doing right now. <laughs> hit you in your stomach we towed him in public i said we towed him in public we tote them bitches in public. He's talking about guns in the verse. <laughs> okay. <laughs> my uh, my song is going to be Nick's absolute favorite song I've ever thrown out, period. Um, it's probably the hardest song I've thrown out onto this show. Uh, I don't know what Spotify was on this week, but it was throwing out some great recommendations to me, and I discovered this awesome hardcore, probably more screamo than hardcore band. Uh, they're called State Faults, and the song I want you to listen to is State Faults Wildfires. Uh, that one is plural. Uh, and it's it's fucking fantastically written. Like, is it is it State Faults Wild Wildfires or is it Wildfires by State Faults? The band is State Faults. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you, okay, okay, go on. <laughs> State Faults Wildfires. There you go. State Faults Dash Wildfires. There we go. Okay. Okay. Um, I can yeah, sleep. It, happy it's tonight. it's uh, super well written. The poetry of it is great. Like even though you're gonna fucking hate it, Nick. Like listen to the lyrics or read the lyrics, and I think anybody can read that from like a poetry perspective not even listening to the music and get something out of it it's just really well well written song i'm very interested did you just give me permission to not listen to it and just read no you gotta you have to listen to it but you should (laughs) listen to it on like one out of 100 Uh, (laughs) i'm interested to see like like coming back next week which which one nick will like better the screaming song or the nine minute one next we need to get a nine minute screaming (laughs) i will legitimately quit the show if that ever comes up (laughs) <laughs> promise all right Guaranteed. we'll see yo dude it's a good song man all right it's just a hater don't worry about it it's all good all right I'm all right so those are our songs <laughs> pretty hard though for the week said two things hopefully this here. video goes live you, so everybody can see it hardcore and screamo past like a day to remember
Therefore, it's not my style. I didn't. I don't say I hate anymore. Okay. Well, <laughs> well, I, I hate like six nine and like those kinds of guys. So it's all good. I'm a hater. I'm a huge so. hater, dude. <laughs> I'm a hater, and I'm proud, man. Let it be known. He's like the only Mexican, you know, doing his thing on the charts. So I mean, he's got that going for him. Got so to me a racist now too. Damn. Yeah, bro. Like, bro. <laughs> bro. You're racist. <laughs> Confirm. Yo. Anyway. So Lane. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> what do you, do you want? Do you hear the news about Nelk, bro? Yeah, holy shit, dude. I don't know what they did. What was the prank that they did? Nobody knows. They never say, dude. I guess they can't say, like, if that's going to be a legal I bet their, their lawyers yeah. are like, don't fucking say a goddamn word right. on camera. Yeah. Sure. Um, he's in jail. Yeah, no, that was, that was crazy. Jail, right? Yeah, Jesse's in jail. Are you going to buy Again. a Jesse mugshot? Piece? Dude, I was honestly thinking about it. <laughs> I was honestly. I was too. <laughs> like, I never bought any of their other merch, like the full sin shit, like full Don't sin care. university or whatever the fuck it was. The Jesse mugshot shirt. But the shirt Jesse mugshot dope. shirt, like, I might have to cop, dude, honestly. Right. It's I don't for know, good dude. Cop. I don't know, bro. But yeah, Nick, you never watched Nelk at all, right? We've probably told you a million times and you never listened to us. Did you ever watch American Vandal? Nope. nope. Um, Do you ever watch any of the Shane Dawson series? Nope. Nope. He's missing out on like super good content. In in oh. Nick, come on, dude. <sighs> come on, man. Come on. I mean, Nelk, Nelk kind of died down a bit, but that's because they went to like their website, right? Or for me, they died down. I don't know. I just they, they came back to YouTube. They've yeah, but they don't more. post as like often as they used to. Right. They've know. been picking it up here recently. They had a couple well, not anymore. Um, no, true. They did uh, eating uh, meat inside a vegetarian uh, restaurant number two. Like they did a, a number two of that. And they got so pissed, dude. Seeing how triggered vegetarians get, and then like <laughs> grub hubbing a bunch of ribs to the vegetarian <laughs> place, and then just chowing is fucking great. A. I mean, they have some good ones in there. Man, okay. Well, I'm excited to see what he did. I mean, he's been arrested multiple times before. Um, this one seemed have... like serious, though. It's they always seem serious. Let's be honest. I mean, this was last time they got arrested. They got they got fucking when they were in by like Mexican cops with coke in the back and didn't get arrested. Yeah, but that was. I mean, come on. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, but like after that, when they were doing like the tour or whatever, and they were in like North Dakota or something, he got he got arrested for something. I don't know if it was like the throwing him off the balcony, like suicide prank thing they did, but it was in that time frame um, hmm. where they got arrested. One of them got arrested, and they, it was like super serious, and then like nothing came of it. But I mean, you never know. I think they, they do stupid shit. So they got a good lawyer. Yeah, That's I guess so, good. man. Like fuck, bro. And you have to if you're where, in that where are they at? Like, like they're they're in the states, right? They were in the States somewhere, I don't know where. And they're Canadian residents. Right, which fucks them a little harder, yeah. apparently. Mm -hmm. Damn. Rip. Yo, Nick, I see that I'm leaving you out over there, so I will chime in with something that you have been doing lately. I chime in with the, haven't you people ever heard of? Keep singing, Listen I don't care. Goddamn door. I was hoping you guys would jump in, but continue. <laughs> <laughs> Nick! Yo. Why are you playing Duel Links? Why? Yeah, what 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 made you like, hey, I want to get back into Duel Links and spend another three thousand dollars? What 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 <laughs> okay. went through your head Hold to make on. you say like want to say that, do that? You I know? have not spent three thousand dollars combined 2, 000, on every whatever. single game I've ever played. Like okay, other than like buying the video game itself, like in microtransactions, I've not spent three thousand dollars combined in every game. But yeah. probably game, close to two. Probably. <laughs> 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 yeah i won't deny that probably close to two go but, on so what did you ask me oh why did i get back into yeah duel why, why were you like i'm gonna um, pick up duel links well it, i mean i'm not like full-fledged back into it per se i just um it was, you know i've been watching a few guns blazing videos again lately i watched his face face reveal uh video and not stream but i clicked on a stream of, of his like later on and i was like oh shit it's his face He's he's a person. He's not just you know. He's not a robot. A oh, okay. He's not a meme lord. <laughs> so um. <laughs> so you've been playing. You've been learning like synchro summoning and all that. I I don't want to get back. Not into really. It. I haven't I haven't done that yet. They um, introduced synchro summoning, using... and I don't want to get back yeah. into the game. Like just I don't. 
But like at, at this point, you're probably so far behind on the packs. Like, how much money do you have to spend to get right back into the game? You know, it is. It's a pretty pay to win game. It's a very pay to win. Yeah, pay to win game. Yeah. But so there's actually some decks you can get for spending. Pre- like you know how it's like thirty bucks for like thirty packs or some shit. Like um, thirty like thirty. Wasn't bucks? that like for real? I think it was thirty dollars for thirty packs plus six hundred gems or whatever i think that's what it was that's a lot of like, fucking money i didn't know it was that much i don't think it was that yeah, much dude there's a um there's a blue eyes like what do they call them starter decks or something that you yeah. can buy for like you can buy one for like a thousand gems or 500 gems or some shit you can buy one like on sale or some shit and then you can buy one normally for like six dollars and you can solid. buy three of those and you'll be set so is this There's gonna be like 30. your pokemon go thing where you're like i'm gonna play pokemon go again and then a week later you just dropped it when did you pick up pokemon go again <laughs> about three times uh, since... over the summer if you... like yeah like twice over the summer <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. and then it's like it's like hey add no. me we're gonna play pokemon go and then yeah. and then he sends no, me so a gift the and then and then it's like so i never opened it again thing. <laughs> here's the thing with my games the games i play in my time so i have my main games i play all the time probably close to every day i got rocket league and fortnite other than those because i get tired of those games because they're highly competitive and i suck at both of them well i don't suck at rocket league but yeah, you do. <laughs> I don't want to make you feel bad, Lane. I, you're not a pro either. Mind, right? I get it. In your mind, mind, you're not like a pro, right? I get it. Yeah, yeah. So when I'm mad at those games or when I'm not in the mood to play those games, I rotate the other games I play. So if I'm bored of RuneScape, which is most of the time, um, although I've been into it a little bit lately. I've been getting into it a lot myself. I'm playing I did right my now. Episode. <laughs> you're in a farm run. doesn't count. Do a Slayer task. I am playing right now. Doesn't man. count. It still counts, man. <laughs> Those accounts. All right. Um, yeah. So I rotate my games like Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links, Pokemon Go. Sometimes I'll just go on a binge of playing like a thousand Sudoku puzzles or solving a thousand Sudoku puzzles. Sometimes I'll do solitaire for a little bit. Like sometimes when I'm out and need something to do, like if I'm, I don't know, taking a shit at work or something. Like I need something to do. Let's be honest I, now, though. Like, like I've seriously, been, dude. There's really nothing else to play now that RuneScape's on mobile. Like, there's, <laughs> like, there's no reason to, to play anything else. And I haven't played Duel Links on my phone yet. I've, only I've played barely it on touched phone. RuneScape mobile. I'm just painting back into Yeah, but RuneScape. when if you're, like, playing something out, you know, out somewhere, like, wh- why play anything else, honestly? You know? Go go sure. AFK some mining or some fishing or whatever, you know? Like, if you're, like... Don't play RuneScape. Well, I mean, honestly... Why would you want to play Duel Links when you can play RuneScape? Bro, a million downloads since launched on iOS. It's insane. On Dude, iOS today, alone. One, I was like middle of the day. 125,000 people concurrently playing. Like, the most I've seen is 142. I don't know I think exactly it's been above it. that. It's been, it's been above that for sure. Yeah. That's the most I've seen. I've seen screenshots of it yeah. like in the 150 and 160. Um, Dude, that's insane. Like that, That's bigger than it was when I was a kid. Yeah. I mean, the game's always been steady around... 80k it, it peaked over uh in the six digits when we were young but not yeah, like, yeah, but like well in past recent years past few years He's since talking about average line yeah since the old school Next release 80, it's sure. been around like the 80 ish k um yeah. and now it's constantly over 100k which is insane a million downloads right. on ios alone in the first week um, imagine how much money jagex is uh, getting off mobile imagine how many people are signing up for members and shit dude people are like getting back into the game Right. Well, awesome. they definitely made the right business move for them financially to increase membership before mobile came out. Because <laughs> if they would have just waited to do that after mobile came out, they wouldn't have made as much money. They'd still make a fuck ton. But mm-hmm. I think they're doing really well. I, I, I think they should put it back down to five dollars. Because fuck them. Yeah. Right. Like, come on, man. Like, how much is it now? It's like ten bucks a month. It's eleven dollars a month. Oh, that, no, that's fucked up, dude. That's too much. Right. Like, I'll pay six or seven bucks. I mean, I pay the 11. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I pay the 11, too. It's a little cheaper if you do it three months at a time. But That's not what I do, yeah. It's, yeah. it's like nine something if you do three months at a well, time. Well, my problem with that is I go in huge spurts of where I want, like, in a three month span, I'll play it for like three weeks. You want me to be month. honest, dude? Two I could months. not play for two years and I'd still keep my membership. It's yeah. just something I pay for every every time, every Factored three months. It's in the yeah. monthly budget. Yep. <laughs> it's just there ever since 
third grade, dude. I think I've always been a member on RuneScape. It's just how it is. I've, I've I'm a little more conscious in, of my shit. I'm, dude, it's like not that much money, but I've definitely been uh, a member since they raised the membership price. That way I don't have to start paying more. Yeah. I mean, I, I stopped it because it used to be literally five bucks. I don't pay five bucks, but I think I pay the previous yeah. amount before the last increase. Yeah, I don't know exactly. I just I don't question the bill. I just pay it, honestly. <laughs> Nick's over here like, I won't buy a RuneScape membership, but the second a Fortnite skin drops, like... Bada boom. I mean, I check them every day. I don't buy them as much as I used to, though. I used to just, like, without even thinking about it, I would just buy I bought it. one skin I've, today. Um, I've made... I think I did a $60 I V-Buck purchase transaction thing. Like well over a month, month and a half ago, and I'm still using V Bucks from that. Like That'd I have like six months of RuneScape membership. No, less than six. Five. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, actually, I don't. There's probably a six month option, and I don't know what that is, but it, oh. it'd probably be sixty. Well, I have a John Wick, so get on my level. Gommel, dude! Holy shit! I haven't seen a John Wick in three seasons. Um, every so time I saw them gone. back in the day, it was the tryhards, and every time I see them now, they suck. I don't, see, I don't even see them now, dude. I see them once in a blue moon. I don't play that much, or I haven't been in the last week or two. I have been and I have since not, I got rid of Fortnite I was... Mares, I haven't played that much. Hated Fortnite. Mares. I mean, there's still it's Team Terror's there. What's it's, it's an LTM. It's the same thing. It's Fortnite Mares. Oh, it yeah, oh. but they just made it an what? LTM. Like they should have in the first fucking place. Um, yeah. <sighs> Yeah. Nah, nah, it fucking sucked, dude. It sucked. Um, that was the worst that update. This was awesome. <laughs> that was the worst <laughs> update they ever put in that game, dude. Fuck, fuck Fort Nightmares, dude. Can't do it. Can't fucking do it. Yo, have you seen um? Yo. What's his name? His name is blanking me now. Scumpy. He's blowing up. How do you feel about Scumpy blowing up? I don't know. I mean, I know Optic Scumpy. Like, I'm aware of the dude. It's the fact that that a Call of Duty streamer is blowing up. Um, yes, he got hosted by Ninja, so he was over like 100k viewers at one point. But he was already at like 16 or 17k subs by the time he got hosted by Ninja. He's well over like 21k subs now. He went from 3k subs to like 21k subs in two weeks, like that. Like, That's like pretty impressive. Like, but cool. but 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 but. But what do you, what what do you what, think what? it does In for pot. like, COD? Because I'm gonna be honest with you, I fucking hate it, dude. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the that, that took no time. Well, COD's not even barely been out a month, and now everybody hates it again. No, 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 like, no. That was such a no, quick no, no. Cycle. The multiplayer sucks. No, I I hate it. I think for the most part, uh, the a lot of the people playing it. It's 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 doing a lot better this year than it has in recent years because I still see a ton of people complaining about the multiplayer is the most shit. broken bullshit in the world and I fucking hate it, dude. And that's why I've not I been playing the game. it. But um but the competitive scene's like blowing up again. Um and the it's like Scumpy is like leading it, dude. Like I, I think it's the fact that that um I mean he's blowing up, he's like going off in the game so it's like scumpy's going off everybody's wanting to watch fucking scum it's like black ops 2 all over again optics actually good again they they won the first 2k without dropping a single map they went 30 and 0 and, and then scumpy got hosted <laughs> by ninja and in the grand finals and they won it um 30 and 0 map count optic gaming's back like scumpy's killing it like i, I don't know man i like the way that the competitive scene looks but they won't release league play yet and I don't know why, and I fucking hate Treyarch, but I can't stand multiplayer on that goddamn game right now, dude, until they fix about 90 fucking things, dude, so. That's why cool. I don't play multiplayer. Actually, I haven't touched the game in a while, but I haven't I'm still down to play zombies dude. if Fuck. other friends buy it. Bro, I'm that still down to go to God Wars Dungeon if you guys want. I'm down. <laughs> Are you really? Let's do it. How do you, how do you, like, how does Monkey and people like that just, like, continuously, um, like, Monkey, if you're watching this, please comment below and tell me. Uh, how, how, how do how you repeatedly. How play that game? Dude, no, but it's like he's constantly <laughs> mad at it. You know what I mean? 
Yeah. And like even he Sync, everybody that plays that game is constantly fucking mad. The difference is I get off. <laughs> you know, <laughs> like they stay on. How? Please tell me how. How do you do it? Why do you do it? I don't. Are you it. asking how because you want to stay on, or you want to know why they do that? I don't really. I don't. I don't. I'd want the game to be fixed. Like so, it's the specialist, dude. It's really the specialists that just piss me off. The specialists are so broken in that game. And I was against them in the first place. If they didn't have specialists or if they added a game mode without specialists, I think the game would be ten times better. Um, but it's just like it's way too much, the specialist bullshit. Uh, but I, I like I want to snipe on a game that's not like dead, you know? So that's the only reason I want to play it. Like I just want to snipe on a game that's not jetpacks and not dead. And like it you sucks. You should so. snipe on RuneScape. Wish I could. Wish I could. <laughs> but you just know a suggestion. You know, so that that that's why I, I want to play it, but I haven't been playing it. I've been playing Snipe with a magic longbow. There, there you go. go. <laughs> I'm down you with can it, make dude. A PKing montage. I'm down with it. Fuck that. Fuck PKing. Dude, what's wrong with PKing? <laughs> it's not for me. What do you? What, PVMing is in either. So like, what? What? <laughs> what no, is it for you? is. I'm just too lazy. It to look is. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> no, I trust me. I want to. Bro, I don't like, think I've ever been anywhere just... else besides Giant Mole with your ass, dude. Like seriously, one Maybe of those times KG. you went to Giant Mole, I was I there waiting boss. with the mage cape. <laughs> I want to boss. I don't want to grind to get up to being able to boss. Nick, let me tell you something, okay? That's that's where let I'm me at. tell you something, okay? This is something I've been telling you for months, like when we were still playing the game constantly, super yeah, consistently. Yeah. Um, <laughs> dude, your account is fine to go like duo or in like even trio easy with us and you can solo some bosses 100 percent, perfectly fine perfectly yeah, fine right. your account is okay it's not, like you're not going to go in and kill fucking corp or anything like that but like you're you can be able to do raids you but... can go to god wars with us and you'll be perfectly sure. fine with like as long as you don't pull a lane and turn off your prayer like in the middle of being attacked by criara like that's it dude like you'll be okay just come with us don't be pussy you know what I mean? I second that. Come along. Let's go to God Wars after this episode, boys. Are you down? I'm so down. I'm playing Rocket League after this. He's a whore. <laughs> <laughs> Filthy I'm one. Play a that. good game. I don't know why, but that's become like my favorite insult right now. I don't know why. <laughs> Dude, if you're really down to go to God Wars Dungeon, I'm gonna grab a bite to eat. We totally can. Yeah, maybe not. Um... <laughs> <laughs> I was expecting that. It's yeah, usually the, well, it's usually about how that goes. You know, <laughs> yeah. You know. Let's do it. All right, let's do it. Oh, you want? Oh. Yeah. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, anyway, I can't tell you how many times. Moving I've had on that to the last thing that I want to say, um, Lane. Do Yo, you have Red you Dead? Just, I don't. I never got it, but I want to. It looks good. Why didn't you get it? Did you, you say Red Dead? Yeah. You yeah. kept saying you were gonna get it. I don't have a good uh, excuse for you. Does He's someone want to too. donate me like four hundred fifty dollars or so, so I can buy an Xbox One X and buy the game? There's no <laughs> way it's that cheap, isn't it? <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> yeah, I mean, ask Monkey. Shit, he went out and bought one to play God. Um, you can I, still play uh, on a regular Xbox too; it just won't be as perfect. Yeah, yeah, I want it to be perfect though. That game looks beautiful, and I want it to look as beautiful as possible. That's why I bought a PC. <laughs> that game looks really fun. I don't know. I got caught up in uh, RuneScape and Rocket League and Forza, and I just didn't get it. I don't have a good excuse. I'll eventually play it. I have to. game looks great. Yeah, so, I might just buy it on console soon, dude. Just fuck it, you know? Four ninety nine. Fuck. Four ninety nine, dude. <laughs> 50 bucks. That's for one way. terabyte. Oh, mega lol. Yeah, yeah, I'm not so going to get it. I'm going to buy a Switch before I get that. I'm That's not gonna true. buy either. I don't think Switch uh, would be cool, dude. I want to play the new new uh, Zelda game too. The I want to play the new Luigi's Mansion. You game. would turn the music off. Probably man. just a remake. I would. You're damn right. I would. What a whore. <laughs> Does that? Yeah. Who turns the music off on, on Zelda, a Nintendo bro? game? Period. Nintendo shit. makes beautiful soundtracks. Shit. You just said it's shit. All right, we're in an episode here. Next week, <laughs> Lane will not be returning with us. Yeah. <laughs> We get Powell or Monkey or somebody. Monkey Fill works in. every day at this time. Monkey is currently at work. Oh. Monkey, I feel so bad for you, dude. How did we get him in that one episode? Did we do it early or something? Uh, no, that was the week in that Black Ops Four dropped, I believe, and or it was the beta. 
I guess it was probably the beta. I guess it was the beta, and he took off. So okay, yeah. So he had time to play. Yeah, so he had time. Um, because I think it was like right before it dropped, or the night it did drop, or something. Mm-hmm. Some I don't. Yeah, it was the night the beta dropped. I think. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, that's dude, how we got. Shout my... out your shirt, go to My go shirt's shirt. fucking dope, dude. Fucking sick, man. All the Cartoon Network Love characters, it. bro. I'm about it. All, dude. Bought it at Hot Topic, man. Twenty bucks. Love it. I can dig. Thunder up, boy. Uh, I'm rocking a Brockhampton shirt. I'm I'm very curious. Real quick, I'm gonna see if the Magic won their game. They did. They won by eight. <gasps> they didn't Uh-oh. joke. Yay. Two nights in a row. Yeah. Or two games in a row. <laughs> All right, yeah. boys. Well, that's about it for me tonight. I would like to end this episode off and get it done before my computer decides to yeah. update. Does <laughs> anybody something. have uh, anything they would like to add? Uh, yo, um, yeah. Two plus two is four. So that's my adding. Solid. Like your addition, bro. Yeah, 11 is the you, answer. <laughs> All right. Uh, I just want to shout out my Thunder because they started the season 0 and 4 and they've All won right, guys, seven we're in a row. The game. I'm just going <laughs> to. And bye. <laughs> <laughs> just, just click off. Yeah. That's, that's pretty much it. We've won seven in a row. We went from dead last in the West, 15th, to we're up to number four in the West now. So hell yeah. Thunder up. Stars are doing good. So shout out Dallas Stars, I guess. Fuck guys are going to lose tomorrow to Michigan State. Calling it now. All my teams suck. Later, guys. <laughs> <laughs> now we got to synchronize our goodbye. Yeah, we do. Okay, you guys ready? Oh, I was born ready. All right, three, two, two. one. Goodbye. Hi. I was yeah. about to wave, and I turned it into a deuce. <laughs>